Hello friends, my Starlink user terminal is here. So you're asking, what is Starlink? Well, Starlink is a network of satellites that provide internet. It's currently built by SpaceX, Elon Musk Aerospace Company. Um, right now, you may have heard, but SpaceX has been launching satellites um, in low, low Earth orbit to provide internet. So the launch has started in May of 2019, and that first launch had 60 satellites, and eventually Starlink will hope to have over 12,000 to provide internet. So I signed up for the beta a few months ago and got on the list and was selected last week. I'll tell you a little more about the beta. So we expect to see data speeds from 50 megabytes to 150 megabytes and latency from 20 to 40 over the next several months. There could be, you know, with any beta, beta periods of no, co no connection, so I'll be keeping my usual internet. Um, the user terminal, which just arrived, cost $500, and then there's also a, a monthly subscription cost of $99 per month. So I currently have Spectrum, which costs about, I think it's $70 a month, and the speed tests I've done have gotten about 50 to 70 megabytes. So if we could get up to 150, and I've even heard of other users, um, up to 2, 250, so that would be a lot faster. Um, currently, the satellites are at our latitude. I'm in Montana. So we'll unbox this, and I'll get it set up. And apparently, it takes less than, like, five minutes to set this up. Okay, I literally put this together in, like, 30 seconds. So in the box is the terminal, which is this spaceship looking disc. The base, which I just stuck that in there. And then it comes already, I think with its own router that also might be a wireless router um, that you need to have in your house, the power and the cord, which you need to bring from outside inside. Um, you do also need to have a good view, clear view of the sky. So there's actually a phone app which you can use to find um, clear sky looking north. Okay, I've got the terminal outside. It is winter here. Um, I did set it up so it was facing my fence, but it has automatically adjusted itself straight up. So maybe that's the best signal. Um, so we'll see how it works.